welcome back to Trails of Cold Steel 4. We have a hot spring scene to get to, and they said to bring all of the original no. Class 7 girls. So I can only imagine that this is going to be... Well, this is going to be every guy's dream, and Reen's the only one who gets it. Reen's going to have a great time today. Here we go. Reen and the others enjoyed the hot springs and took their time resting in the village. Soon enough, a familiar group found themselves together in the open-air bath. Ah, isn't he a lucky man? Why is Celine here too? Um, looks like I'm the odd man out here. I'll just be... <laughs> no need to be shy, Reen. These aren't any... These aren't any worse than swimsuits. Nothing scandalous here. It's pretty different, you know. Besides, we even have Toa here with us this time. You sure do. This has me... This has got me thinking back to when we went to the hot springs in Ymir. Time really flies. I'm still not sure why I need to be here, let alone in human form. Well, either way, I'm glad you agreed to make an exception and tag along, Celine. Can you believe you're all green? You basically have your pick here, if you catch my drift. Yeah, I'm pretty sure everyone does, but I can't say I deserve any of this. Why not? I'm the one to blame for the crisis the world is in now, the Great Twilight. And yet here I am, relaxing with my close friends. I've got so many people I can lean on and trust. I really don't deserve to be so lucky. Don't be so harsh on yourself. I think you deserve it. Reen, it's really alright. Times like these are really precious, so we gotta make the most of them. Agreed. If you, uh, if you wish, I'll scrub your back for you. Take some of the edge off. Then I'll take care of his hair. Uh, guys? I can help tend to your ears too if you would like. I'll be on shoulder massage duty. This is all a little too much, don't you think? <laughs> you made the girls feel sorry for you, so this is what you get now, Reen. I'll grab us some drinks, and maybe a snag a bite or two. And so, after an extraordinary decent soak, Reen stumbled out of the hot springs, recharged in a variety of ways. <laughs> it was nice to have Toa there. Okay. You know, honestly. I think it's time to put it back on. Why not? Anyway, back to St. Ark. Jeez, dog, you're gonna break the floorboards. Jumps in on the floor all the time like that. But I had had myself a little break before this episode, so... Just wanted to let you know. We've had so many orders and repair requests for military uniforms from Titus Gage recently. I thought they only had a handful of troops stationed there to watch the border with Oberl. For some reason we've had orders for new recruit uniforms from the 1st Division and the 16th Armor Division. I better not think about it, or the Armor Division is going to pass through the Kingdom of Oberl to wage war on Calvert. There's a lot we can deduce, but perhaps it's best if we didn't inter interest ourselves too much in military matters. No. Actually, you know what? Nah, not yet. I don't want it on. It just don't... It reminds me of a day, but it just don't feel right at the moment. I've only been hearing bad things about Kleist and Co. recently. People are saying they're in weak with the government and are covering up illegal activity. They were so popular, but now they've disappointed so many. I want to eventually visit quite small, but in light of recent news, I think I won't. That's just so disappointing. Hold on. Before I forget. This needs to be fixed. You can get the hell out.
Anything? Nothing. The delivery service I operate with my husband has started up again. Recently, my husband's truck was requisitioned by the military, but it just so happened that Kweising Co. on managing Director Hugo's orders began to support business orders and the flow of the goods. My husband borrowed a truck from the company, so he's been able to resume his deliveries. I had no idea what we were going to do for a while. I'm going to work hard with my husband to make this a, a relaunch success. All right. Oh hey, Tovo passed me a secret visit just earlier. He was doing much better than I thought he'd be. It was such a relief, but he really does like to cause a scene, huh? Ah, Tovo showed up here. Yeah, I used to provide some assistance at the Guild St. Art branch back in the day, so Tovo and I are well acquainted. The branch may be gone, but there still needs to be somebody to sort the help request and provide weapons to the bracers. We've also been collaborating with the Graham with the Graham branch in certain cases. I see, that makes sense. This gives me a newfound appreciation for Miles and all the work he does at the Lagram branch to sustain his information network. I heard about your situation. I can't do much, but I do hope to fully support you and the Bracers. If you ever need weapons or armor, you're always welcome in my store. Thank you very much. Wasn't this guy, didn't he have a hold? Didn't the curse have a hold of that guy before? I can't remember. The bookstores in the capital are voluntarily removing bookshelves, the books published in Bur Wait a minute. Didn't she talk about that already? That felt very familiar. When I ran out of herbs, a merchant called Eclaws, who hears his subtype, helped me out. Next to him, I should be able to make the the salve, the salve, the slave, whatever that the ruler church needs. He's an interesting young person. He has a deep and understanding of medicines as I do, and knowledge of many traditions and legends. For a time, I suspected he had some relationship with Eclaws. But there are so many interesting young folk these days. Eclaws, could that be the guy from Erin Village? He's supporting St. Ark in secret as a regular person. That gives me some confidence. More and more people are being conscripted for the war effort. Fortunately, there are many brave folks here. But I'm sure they'll be nearing their breaking point, even if they're not showing it. I just hope that we can bring some relief to everyone's hearts, just like the performance earlier. I finally finished tilling the soil. I decided to uh, cultivate olives in this patch. Vegetables and trees require a different method, so there's a ton of studying I have to do. Why do I want to plant olives? That's a secret. Everyone's depressed before the war, but no matter what trials we face, we must keep pushing forward. Thank you for such a gr generous contribution. Please allow me to offer my gratitude. Please don't worry, the Archbishop already thanked me. I was worried that it wouldn't just be the medicine you... That it wouldn't... Yeah, okay. I was worried that it wouldn't just be the medicine you needed, but gauze and bandages. I just hope my contribution will help you restock. Thank you so much for your concern. We will use your donation wisely. We've had a lot more guests arguing with each other, but when the manager talks to them, they end up calming down for some reason. His nonchalant, laid-back attitude is actually saving us for once. I'm sure he'll manage to take care of that argument over there, too, so there's no need for you to worry. You say General Rick Wynn is part of the rebel forces? Know your place, commoner! I haven't heard anything about General Rick Wynn from the newspapers or the radio. I was just saying it was suspicious. Exactly! Weren't you implying that the General is part of the Rebellion by saying that? Would the government announce, announce that General Week Wynn is at the front line waiting for an opportunity? This is seriously detrimental to the war morale! Manager, call the Imperial Defense Force immediately! Come now, please calm down. You both seem to have expectations of General Week Wynn. We don't have much information. Why don't you discuss what you do know calmly? 
<clears throat> you have a point. Maybe it's good to hear the positive rumors. I'll bring you some tea. I hope you find common ground. They're, concern they're concealing the existence of the Vicewind Army with that kind of excuse, huh? The doll, the dolly, wait, dollies? I, I think that is just dollies. Or Dallas? Yeah. I've been looking after my master's place are blooming beautifully. Wait. Hmm. If only he could have seen them. I let my mind wander into such a depressing thought of train of thought. I'll have to pick, a, pick one of these and press it. That way he'll know how well they turn out when he gets back. E I spoke with uh, Dine, uh, Dina, and half of our harvest is going directly to our stall. Hopefully that will bring in the mirror we need to plant our next crop. First we'll do everything we can to revitalize the stall. Rika and I, yeah, Rika and I are running this little stall together now. I reviewed how the stall was being managed till now to see if we could keep it going. There's no longer an inventory problem, but we're still only getting by on the skin of our teeth. I see. Yeah, we don't need to go that way, okay. I heard there were requisiting grain from my contacts back at the food agency. They said there's nothing we can do at this point but cooperate. The way things are, it's only a matter of time before bread becomes a luxury item. War or no, if we don't put proper priority on our food supplies, the country has no future. Dear, how about we speak to Marcus Ballard? Oh yes, it couldn't hurt to try at least. I'm sorry, my dear. I know I said we enjoy the last years of our life in peace, and now this arises. Well, I've been waiting for you to retire and come home for the last 30 years. Waiting a little longer won't make that much difference. Ada and I submerged a radish in wa a, a radish in water. It's begun to sprout leaves. Apparently all you need is a simple radish stem, and you can cultivate weaves that are just as edible as the veggie itself. I would never have known if I hadn't looked it up. It's quite fun to learn about how little life hacks like that. Hey, did you hear? Miss Fiona came to the concert and she taught me so much. I just need to get the beat and it'll be perfect. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Hmm, matching with the beat is tough. I hear the 1st and 16th Bomb Divisions are mustering their forces at the Tetis Gate. They must be setting up to advance to Calvert from the Bavarian border. At this rate, things are going the whole... At the rate things are going, the whole continent may be consumed by the Great War. Considering the disparity in military compa compatibilities, human casualties are inevitable. I plan to consult with Marcus High Arms on how I can support those who survived the war. Phew, I'm really busy. My wife and, and I's delivery service for her luxury grocery store is back up and running. After my truck was requisitioned, I was sure I'd hit the end of the road on it. But Rosumi knocked the sense back into me and I borrowed a new one from Christ & Co. I've got to hustle out there. I don't want to put any more stress on my wife than she already has. Hey, hey, hey. Isn't the Emperor's surgery happening soon? Empress Priscilla and Princess Alphen must be besides themselves with worry. There may still be Covetarian spies around, so it may be difficult for them to go outside. But I really do hope the two of them are able to pay the Emperor a visit soon. I see. His Majesty. It'd be great if we could visit the Emperor, too. I was surprised when Coyle wanted to hear more when yeah, when Coyle wanted to hear some stories. Ooh, he said he couldn't get into the swing of things if I didn't, so it seems his rebellious phase ended pretty quickly. Oh, and lately all the plants of my store have been begun withering. It's said that things like this are harbingers of ill tidings, but in reality war is almost upon us. I can't help but feel it really was an omen. 
I swallowed my pride and asked Dad for a story again. He was weirdly happy. I don't actually have any interest in his old tales. I just wanted to get my mind off things. Uh, there are a lot of people coming to make orbit adjustments because of the wild monsters, but rationing makes it getting new stock difficult. It's not a rebellious phase or anything, okay? It's not a phase, Dad. This is just who I am. Still don't know where to get that. I've got a lot of people who will be leaving for the army stopping by these days. They come in and sell their precious heirlooms and artwork so they can leave some mirror behind for their family while they're away. Just the other day a man came in with the watch his grandfather had given him. It's painful to imagine the amount of hardship my customers must be going through to part with such treasured valuables. Mom and Dad wrote a letter saying that we should devote ourselves to the Empire, and that soldiers should die for the Great Erebonia if that's what it takes. That's just so wrong. Mom and Dad are so wrong about all of this. I agree, Iran. We can't treat human life as dispensable. From what I can tell in their letter, they're planning to come pick you up in a few days. So please remember this. Don't lose sight of what you know is right, and be sure to follow your heart. Poor kid's got it rough. Wanda, Albert, and Kaiser Dice. I will go training in Nord is going all right. My contact managed to persuade the supervisor at Zender Gate. He managed to get them to Nord safely. Many have left Dines because of their public image while others have been conscripted. They're the only hope left for the club. If all we hope to is have a future after the war, it is my best interest to make sure they're thriving out there. I got a response from Nash. Coria, I had no idea you were so madly in love with me. I can't promise that I'll marry you, but if I come back from the war in one piece, I wouldn't mind going out with you. What the hell kind of fantasy world is that dummy living in? And what does he mean if he comes back in one piece? Enough with the hero act, Nash. Just cut the crap and come home already. Mm-hmm. Alright. Finally, we're done there. And now, we gotta go with all the places here. So let's go ahead and get... What is out here? What could possibly be out here? Could we not go here before? I don't think we've gone here yet. Oh, we haven't. There's a quest, and I think that's one of the people we need going. to be going after. <laughs> ready to ride. I seriously love the way Tillis is ready to ride. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, hey. Yeah, I can't go over there right now, it seems. Just because there's a main quest there, and I don't want to... What game did I think I was playing that pressing down Let's on the D-pad was going to do? Let's ah, I'll save you. Ready to ride. I'm up. What? How do we still hear that? Let's fall back. Keep moving. Now we've all taken unnecessary damage for no reason. Nothing over here. Damn it. Let's get going. <laughs> Ready to ride. She just sounds so psyched about uh, getting ready to drive. I just love it. Damn it. Yeah, that treasure chest is still hidden over there. Seventh Catapult. 
That ain't no seven slash. I remember when I would grind the hell out of you guys. I might actually still grind the hell out of you. What? It's you again. Back for a round two, are ya? Actually, it'd be a round three. Yeah, it'd definitely be like a round three. Let's get going. <laughs> ready to ride. She's ready to ride the towmobile. chance to come here during our field exercises yeah it can't hurt to check this area out just in case well look at me finding stuff I don't you're in the way oh wait that's right let's get going <laughs> ready to ride haha <laughs> I've got you beat I guess we'll go right first maybe Oh, well, we're stuck there. Yeah, I'm stuck. Can't move. Don't worry, Toa. I know how to do this. Whoa. What's this? Nothing to do over there. Let's get going. <laughs> Ready to ride. How do we go? Oh, yeah. I could do some level grinding. Probably. Depends what level these guys actually are. I mean, I'll go back to the ship so I could figure that out myself. Oh, I see fish in the water. There. there. Got a bite. Haha, -ha, my promising. boy. Uh, it's just another shark. Got it. What the hell are you? My man has seen many battles. There. Got a bite. This is promising. <laughs> Not bad at all. I'm gonna test out something. Oh crap, you saw me. Let's go. I'm just gonna use everything because it won't matter. Unforgivable. All right. Hold fast. Black tortoise formation. It's my turn. You can't escape. Fire! I'll handle this. Azure Cleaver. Now! Just wanna find out how much XP I get from one from one fight with these guys. Second form down! It's down! Laura, now! Yes, yes! Tough. Yeah. Now! Riona, activate! Fire! Wide open! I'll assist! I'll handle this! Great! Now! Yeah! Battle nice. complete! Let's, Let's continue! I can, I can multiply that into something! If you go in a three phase fight, I don't know. I probably won't. But just imagine three fights of that right there. That's what I did in Cold Steel 3. That's when I was first able to get Reen's Helix Strike. Do that later. Be wary. That foe is fearsome. I think there's something above us. 
Damn it, I can't go anywhere with you in my way. It's up. What that is one this means place? business. Either there's something above me or No, no. The clips have been worn away for over the years by the flow of the tide. Seeing this room makes you feel small in the face of nature. I mean Looking good. I'll send a direct when I get the chance. Hmm. Oh boy. This place seems to be full of strong enemies. A powerful foe. Ready yourselves. Can I wink the three of Oh my god, if I could get the three of these together. Some treasure. Hmm. Maybe that might be something. I don't know, I keep thinking, oh I could go here and get some level grinding done, or go here. But do I really need some level grinding? I don't know. Where am I trying to figure something out at? Get the chest. Um, Alright, now we're gonna go on ahead and go back. Oh, ah, well, look at here. Did I actually get inside? Sure. Well. See, this is the music that should be playing on the... This should be playing... On the Courageous 2. But it isn't. I can actually use this terminal to report my, my progress. Let me in. No issues with Mana Engine. Heaven Reach with Mana Engine. Heaven Reach Chariot. Bridge preparations are proceeding as a space as well. That said, there are still s there are some specially po specialized parts we need. I'd better contact the Foundation immediately and have some sent over. Would have been funny if Reen still said, if I go out here, I'll die. I came running as soon as I heard. This isn't looking good. The engine over our energy system has sustained considerable damage. It's going to take a lot of time to repair. I see. The central heaven we journeyed is fine. So getting things back to normal is definitely possible. Now that we're here, I'll dig deep and once again find the courage, I know. I have to get us through this. You can rest easy, I promise. Hello, everyone. So this is where you were. I knew about the emergency landing, but I didn't expect to find you here, Bridget. I came running as soon as I heard about what happened. The time we spent at Thor's meant a lot to me. I couldn't just ignore you in your time of need. Thank you so much, Bridget. We can all use the help we can get, we can get with these repairs. Leave it to me. Min taught me a lot about orbital science. I'm actually rather handy. So these Grawls, Ritter, was it? You've been with them this whole time, Rosine. I'd love to hear more about some of the work you've done. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm not allowed to go into too much detail. That's okay. I know things can be how things can be when you're sworn to secrecy. But my help might be worth a story or two, don't you think? <laughs> Looks like Bridget twisted her arm. She may not look it, but she's quite the negotiator. Anyway, it's going to be really handy to have the Merkaba back in working order. Good luck with the repairs, girls. Thanks, we'll give it our best. Good luck to you, too. I'll see you soon, okay? Rex. 